how is it about, what is it about this novel? Is it also maybe an experiment of alternating history, of a game of what if, what would have happened mm -hmm. if I would have stayed in Iran? Very much so. That's how it started. I mean, in 2007, when I started to write the book, I, at that point, I was so, so fascinated with my own background and roots, and I, I just wanted, uh, you know, I, I asked my father to send me all the photos that he had left, and same with my mother, and um, I started to gather photos and, you know, books and things from anyone who had any, and, and I, um, um, yeah, I was very much asking that question, who would I be if I had stayed, you know, especially in that little village where my father grew up, you know, would I be very much like him, would I be like my cousins, um, at some point, long after I left, I uh, gained a half-sister, um, and I don't know her at all, um, what is she like, would I be anything like her, and would I be proud of that person, and vice versa, and so the idea of writing a dual na narrative felt very cathartic and attractive to me at that point, and that's what I started to do. I wrote an American story, I wrote an Iranian story, and in the first draft there were 300 pages of each, and, <laughs> and <laughs> neither one was in somebody else's imagination. There were, you know, th 300 just straight, you know, kind of realism narrative um, pages in each of those. And um, at the end I decided to get rid of the Mass Hub story, um, for the most part, and put it in Saba's imagination, because the Saba story, the Iran story, seemed the one I was most interested in, most invested in, and it seemed, seemed more important, you know, um, the, the one that I wanted to tell, so. But, you know, you mentioned about the parallels with my own life, and I have to say, if there is a character that is the most like me, that is based on me, it's not Saba, it's not Saba. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, that's true. <laughs> but why do you laugh? Yeah, but it's I laugh. <laughs> I don't know if they laugh because of it. I laugh because uh, it's Saba who's telling the stories about oh, Mata. Yes, so exactly. <laughs> so now you can see how narcissistic I am. <laughs> <laughs> you can't really separate no, 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 you these two girls. Yeah. Yeah. But I feel that Mata has become a bit of a caricature of me. Yeah. You know?